Hey everyone, I want to do a quick video talk about uh, using uh, fungicides um, after a cold weather event like we've had here in Central Texas. So uh, I use uh, this product by Southern Ag, it's called Liquid Copper Fungicide. That is a traditional fung fungicide and it's really effective for using on palms. Um, a couple things to really note about it. This is a toxic chemical. So one, it's toxic, toxic to both to humans, animals, um, and frankly, you want to protect. So use a mask when you're actually spraying this. Um, it's toxic around your pets, so be careful around them. And it's really toxic around um, water, um, aquatic. So uh, if you've got koi ponds or other aquatic ponds with animals, or even just run off into your local water system, be careful um, about where you use it. Um, it also is, uh, using too much of this product um, can cause to copper toxicity in your plants, um, which is just as equally as bad. So follow the directions carefully. So in this case, using this, um, typically it's one to, or sorry, excuse me, two to five teaspoons per gallon of water. Uh, for my palms, I use about three teaspoons per gallon in a, a sprayer bottle, and um, I treat all my plants with that. Um, the trick is to get it down into the um, crown of the palm as well as on the leaves. It's really good. Now, really important to note, copper fungicide is a preventative. It is not a curative. So the trick is you want to use this as soon as after you've had an event like that and before you start seeing evidence of disease. If you have disease in there, you can use this. Um, but it really is intended to be sort of a predator. So there's really good instructions. I recommend everyone follow those. Um, liquid copper fungicide is a really good um, uh, treatment uh, and has, I found it to be a really uh, effective way to uh, treat some of the, the diseases that might occur after an event like we've had here. So good luck, everyone.